<laughs> so this is the thing like my my boyfriend my fiance my husband <laughs> has always known that like i want like it has been like one of my greatest fantasies to have like a proposal like you know i like all of those romantic stuff If you're new here, you are most welcome to my YouTube channel. You already know what to do. Kindly hit the subscribe button below to join my amazing YouTube family. So today, I'm going up a breed to have um, a photo shoot with my husband-to-be and a photographer. So yeah, I decided to take you guys along. So let's go up the mountain and see what happens there yeah i decided to vlog for you guys i hope you enjoyed this vlog and don't forget to subscribe so we just got up the mountains um we are currently at the every botanical gardens um we found the perfect street or a perfect place for our photo shoot the photographers are setting up however when we got here my man chose a particular street like he said he liked the way the trees were arranged and all of that so he would want us to still take pictures at that particular street i didn't understand him but then i understood everything when the whole photo shoot was over like i understood why he was so particular about that particular street you know And while we were busily taking our photos, his two friends, um, Emeka and Eddie, were on the other side of the garden, like on some other road, getting the car ready. Like, I appreciate the fact that they actually took videos for me because they knew I needed for my vlog. Like, look at Emeka getting this car ready. He actually put the ribbons on himself guys you don't need a friend like a mecca in your lives i'm serious like i'm damn serious he's such a keeper if you have a friend like a mecca in your life you need to keep him for life like i appreciate him so 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 much i really can't believe this i i still can't believe this happened to me i really can't believe this happened to me and oh a mecca's wife if what if what did it kumasa Though Ifwa was all the way in Canada, she was one of the master planners. Like, Ifwa made sure this proposal happened. And I can't thank her enough. I really can't thank Ifwa and Emeka enough. These two human beings are so, so, so selfless. And all I can say is God bless you. And I appreciate you too. Yeah. So at this point, I had seen a car coming from behind us, but then I thought it was just one of those cars because we had had about three or four cars come to pass already. So when it gets close, we just step aside for the car to pass. And when I noticed the car had ribbons on it, I thought it was um, people who had had their wedding and they had come up there for a photo shoot or something. So yeah it just it didn't click that's just the thing it didn't click and at this point i had seen one of his friends appear behind the photographers so i was thinking oh he's meeting salon there and because he's seen us taking like pictures he's also pulled out his phone to take pictures of us and yeah i was asking ah what is eddie doing here this was me stepping aside for the car to pass i hadn't seen the number plate i hadn't seen the car was mine and he said that is my car Oh, 
Yeah. <laughs> so, you can actually get there. Look to us here for us, please. <laughs> Can we get the knees, please? Yay! <laughs> Guys, so um, yesterday I had like one of my greatest fairy tales becoming a reality, and to my biggest surprise. I couldn't even shed a tear like not even a single drop of tear like I was I don't know I was just shaking throughout that was that was what happened to me I was just shaking the entire time but I couldn't even cry like <laughs> oh god so this I don't know you you guys have already seen what happened so yeah we're supposed to have it was supposed to be a photo shoot session for pre-wedding shoot blah 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 and all of that good stuff and like we got there and this man was so busy on the call to his friend i i saw that he was busy he, he at a point he said we should excuse him he like went aside to talk to his friend so we're taking the pictures out of nowhere i saw like one of his friends come from from like in front of us where the the photographer was and he was with his phone videoing us or taking pictures so i just figured oh he's meeting salom there to give him something and obviously since he has seen us like doing a shoot he just wants to snap or something it's so, like it didn't even click then i see this car coming from behind us and i see some ribbons on it but i thought it was like people who have had their wedding and they came up there for like a photo shoot or something like it didn't click not at all even when the car was like so close to us so when the car was getting close it slowed down so i thought oh the person has also noticed that we are also having a shoot so like he's just taking his time for us then it gets very close and i don't know if you guys even saw from the video i was like moving aside for the car to actually pass see at that moment i didn't even notice the the number plate because i thought it was a car that's passing a wedding car I didn't look at the number plate. I didn't see my name there. Like, God, I was so, so, so surprised. And he proposed to me. So this is the thing. Like, my my boyfriend, my fiancé, my husband <laughs> has always known that, like, I want, like, it has been, like, one of my greatest fantasies to have, like, a proposal. Like, you know, I like all of those romantic stuff. He is romantic as well, but I really didn't think he was going to do it because he's he's not really um like a camera guy and he's sometimes shy so i didn't think he was going to do it though he knows like that is something i've like always wanted i didn't expect him to do it because knowing the kind of person he is i didn't expect it to happen and for him to actually like go out of his way to do it to make me happy like it means a lot to me it really really means a lot to me um i don't know i really don't know i really don't know like it just it just took me by surprise trust me because it's just a week it's just a week to our traditional marriage and i thought it wasn't going to happen like <laughs> i thought it wasn't going to happen and for him to actually do it I appreciate it i just thank all the wonderful people who put this together to make sure i'm happy to put a smile on my face to my man i love you baby um to all the master planners nella emeka efua eddie all of you like all of you i i really do appreciate i really do appreciate every single one of you god richly bless you so yeah that's that's just about it um i don't know i don't know um 
I'm so happy and grateful. Um, I'm really grateful to have like wonderful people in my life. God bless all of you. God bless you. Yeah, guys. So that's just it, and that's me in my new car. And yeah. <laughs> Oh, God. Uh...